I've asked Skip Sweeney and his people to keep the camera running and keep the lights on and keep the equipment here while I talk a bit uh, to, uh, in a kind of last video lecture to be posted uh, at that time when I, how to put it, join my ancestors, uh, move into the afterlife, all the, all the circumlocutions that we have for avoiding the simple word dying. So anyway, at that time, I want to have this uh, final thing uh, posted saying generally that I'm very happy to have discovered this new medium late in my life after a whole many decades of lecturing, giving video, uh, it's not video lectures, but slide lectures and uh, publishing and so all the rest of it. Some, somehow this new medium, I was fortunate enough to discover through the help of some people, this new medium which allows me to put so much of what I think I still understand and know, apart from what other people know, in a way that preserves it and, and presents the images better than anything I had available earlier. So at any rate, um, so I want to say how, how happy I've been to be able to, to move into this new medium and to present these at great length, absolutely no, <laughs> no limitations, um, and just to sort of do sort of a general farewell. There's a book behind me on the shelf. I don't, I don't have to get it down because I know it by Clarence Day. Clarence Day was a playwright, author, and so on, best known for a, something called Life with Father, but I don't, that's not my favorite. Uh, the, my favorite is a book, which most people don't know, called Scenes from the Mesozoic. And it's one of the three American funnies, which I present in my video of that title, uh, along with works by Gillette Burgess and George Price. And in that, uh, Clarence Day has a whole series of essays with pictures, excuse me, of, of verses with pictures. And the last of them, which I don't have to open the book for, but I can get, uh, I'll, I'll give it to Skip Sweeney later to copy the picture. The picture, anyway, this is the last of his series, and it's about himself, and it shows him himself uh, caricatured by himself with his glasses on, being pulled off the screen by some creature. And he is saying, and, I, and the verse goes, Farewell, my friends, farewell and hail. I'm off to seek the Holy Grail. I cannot tell you why. Remember, please, when I am gone, t'was aspiration led me on. Tiddly, widdly, toodaloo, all I want is to stay with you, but here I go, goodbye. So there, that uh, a suitable verse, not very profound, but just right for my purpose to uh, uh, sort of bid farewell and, and say how happy I've been to have this, as I say, long and successful and rewarding career with so many marvelous people in it and so many publications and all the things that I've loved doing. And so tiddly widdly toodaloo and farewell. Uh, uh, yours truly, James Cahill. The end. Turn off the machines. Thank you.